Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Eating with Nick. And today we're here in Sunway Resort Hotel to check out the Sunset Terrace and its Ramadan buffet. So let's go have a look, shall we? So we're going to start off this video by looking at the food, uh, the Western food actually. So we start off with the duck confit as well as a beef lasagna. And uh, we've also got prawn, garlic and chili as well as some grilled vegetables. And now it's where it gets a bit more interesting. We've got Middle Eastern dishes as well with a signature dish, which is lamb tagine, as well as couscous. We've also got bamia with tomato, roasted potato with za'atar, as well as Kazakh lemon chicken. Moving on, we've also got Turkish pizza. Uh, the name for Turkish pizza is pide. And um, I've tried this before in other places and it's really, really good. Full of cheese, really full of flavor, really good stuff. And finally, we've also got a little pasta station with a variety of different sauces, as well as different types of pasta itself. So we're starting off now with the Malay food, where we've got murtabak, fried asparagus or kacang panjang goreng, udang masak lemak, as well as ayam puyo. We've also got nasi lemak with blue rice, which looks awesome. White rice, which if you're not a fan of blue rice, you got white rice. Soup ekor, as well as bubur lambo. And now for the Chinese food, we're starting off with chicken rice, a classic, as well as something that I really love, which is a uh, crab meat soup. It just smells so good. So, so good. Moving on, we've also got a bunch of different vegetables to be used with the prawn mi soup. And uh, I can't wait to try this out as well because it looks quite interesting and very, very healthy. I gotta go on a diet, so. And moving on, we've got assorted paos and assorted dim sum to be used with uh, hoisin sauce and chili sauce, as well as cheese bread dumplings and fried sui kao. And moving on, we've got kam hyong chicken, prawn ball salted egg, yong tau fu, as well as braised fish. And moving on, we have got a naan and tandoori chicken station and it looks amazing. We've got a roast beef station that also contains roast chicken and a bunch of different sauces you can use with it. Uh, furthermore, we've also got um, chicken satay, beef satay, and nasi impit with, of course, a traditional peanut sauce. And finally, we've got beef rendang, chicken rendang, lemang, and this beautiful roast lamb. It's just mwah, chef's kiss. And now the outdoor area also has some food which primarily focuses on meats. And the first thing you guys will see is the shawarma station as well as the lamb uzi station. And it just looks so, so good. Like look at those sauces, wow. And now for something a bit healthier, we've got like the vegetable section where we're gonna be starting off with rojak boa. We've also got a bunch of different karabu such as karabu jantung pisang as well as karabu puchuk paku. We've also got dates and raisins, as well as a beautiful, because I love salads, a beautiful salad station. Look at all these dressings. We've got lemon dressing, sesame sauce, Caesar dressing, Thousand Island. Personally, these are my favorite things to use in Subway. I'm kidding, but they taste great with salads and I really would recommend you guys to check this out, especially if you're looking for a healthier diet. You know, all this talking has got me really thirsty, but thankfully I've got a Teitarik station that has me covered. Oh, that's the stuff. And for those of you who have a sweet tooth but prefer healthier options, we've got a bunch of different fruits for you guys to enjoy. We've got rambutan, dragon fruit. I think that's watermelon. Um, I forgot the name of this one, but it's something to do with snakes. Snake fruit. It's snake fruit. Thank you very much. I know it's Ramadan, but something I just love all around, like year round, is uh, sushi. And I just, Japanese cuisine just. It's soul food for me, you know? I love the salmon, I love the tuna, I love the assorted sushi. It's just amazing. And we've also got clams, mussels, more mussels. They've gone down though, I've not gone to the gym in like a year. And prawns. Now, finally, we're at the dessert section where we're gonna start off with some Malaysian classics such as appam balik, gulab jamun, and tau fu fa. Tau fu fa, personally, is one of my favorites for Malaysian desserts. It's just, it just hits home, you know? SS2. And moving on, we've got a bunch of Malay kueis in the spirit of Ramadan. Unfortunately, the only one that I know is uh, koi lapis. And oh, and that is buah malacca. 
And ending off the dessert section, we've got some international ones such as strawberry panna cotta, some mixed fruit tartlets, uh, some cakes, some really beautiful cakes. Look at this walnut velvet cake. It's just to die for with the little macarons on top. It's just perfect. And that's all for today's video review of the Sunset Terrace Ramadan Buffet here in Sunway Resort Hotel. If you guys enjoyed the video, please do like and subscribe as it makes me very, very happy. And I'll catch you guys very, very soon.